The entree comes from Tom Tom, a laid-back bistro in Atlanta. At taping time, the chef was Ian Winslade. Born in Waltham Chase, England, he began his career in London, then cooked in Bermuda and New York, including the famous Le Bernardin. In 1993, he joined Tom Tom. Here is his barbecue salmon on white cheese grits. Today I'm going to demonstrate um, uh, barbecued salmon with white chili cheese grits. At Tom Tom we make our own barbecued sauce. It's tomato based. It has um, must Dijon mustard in it, Worcester sauce. It's a little pe piquant and um, we start off by caramelizing red onions and then adding the tomatoes to it and cooking it very slowly. Um, also we prepare a sesame coleslaw to finish the top with and that is shredded green cabbage that's been uh, macerated with a hot olive oil and rice wine vinegar mixture and it's allowed to stand for about four hours so it pickles. To start with I'm going to make, prepare the grits. And this is a poblano chili. I just clean the inside of the chili. Cut it into a fine dice so its flavor infuses into the grits and it's very edible. I also have an Anaheim chili. And I cut it exactly the same way. Now moving over to the stove, I bring my half and half up to the boil, add the finely minced garlic, and the grits we use at Tom Tom are a quick grit method, they take seven minutes to cook. And I find them uh, to be better than the old style because they don't absorb so much liquid. I'm going to add the, add the chilies to the milk. And as it comes up to a boil, slowly whisk in the grits. Whisking very slowly just to assure that nothing burns on the bottom. Once the liquid comes back to the boil, I'll turn it down to a very slow heat and cook it gently, adding a little salt and pepper for seven minutes. Until the grits themselves absorb the liquid and become tender. Once the grits have cooked for seven minutes and thickened up, I add a jalapeno jack cheese, which is a basic white jack cheese with a mixture of um, hot dried chilies added to it. Fold that in slowly. And then set the grits off to the side to keep warm. Now I'm going to take my salmon steak. We're using Atlantic uh, farm raised salmon. Brush it with a little olive oil. Season it carefully and evenly on both sides with salt and pepper. I 
brush my grill with a little oil just so that the salmon doesn't stick to it. I'm going to cook it fast over a high heat. And for presentation purposes, once you've got a nice color, it's nice to turn it 90 degrees so you get a nice crisscross pattern on the top. Once you can see the edges of the salmon start to change color, turn it over and cook it on the other side. That way it'll be evenly cooked all the way through. Now I take my barbecue sauce. Carefully spoon it on the top side of the salmon, on the presentation side. And I finally just put it under the broiler for one minute, just to set it completely. We cook it to a nice medium rare. Okay, once the salmon is cooked to medium rare, I take my grits that I've kept warm on the side. Spoon them into the ring. Try not to compress them too much so they lose their airiness. Take the ring off. Place the salmon on top of the grits. And we decorate around the plate with a jalapeno glaze, which is made with lime juice, tomato, fresh tomatoes cooked down and infused with jalapenos at the end to give it a little spice, a little uh, basil oil. And we finally dress the top of the plate. For sesame coleslaw, for a little garnish, a few chopped chives. And there we have it: barbecued salmon on white cheese grits. Thank you.